Hello guys, welcome to the another video of Visual C++ Windows Form application. In this video I will show you how to open a video in your form. So this is a window player which I have embedded in the form and for example I choose a path of a video and I press start video so video will start and when I press stop video video will stop so how uh, do I do it I will show you now so first of all what I have done is I have gone to my toolbox I right clicked it and I click choose items and then on the tabs I selected com components and then I went at the bottom and I selected windows media player just check it and press ok what it will do is it will create a tool in your toolbox called windows media player when you drag this windows media player in here it will look like the same so this is a windows media player just resizes according to your use and then what I have done is I have taken three buttons one for starting the video second for stopping the video and third for choosing the path of the video and in here this text box I will use to show the path of the video okay so one two three four five things I have taken for showing the video now what I will do first of all you can change the name start stop of your buttons and then I will select my choose video button and double click it and I will reach to its code and I have added these three lines into my code so what I have done is I have added open file dialog cap your variable name you can give any variable name GC new open file dialog once again this one copy and paste it here. and then copy this variable paste it here and arrow pointer show dialog and then copy the name of your text box which is this text box sorry this text box my text box name is text box 1 so once again I will go to the code I will paste this text box name here and arrow pointer text is equal to once again copy this variable and paste it here arrow pointer file name so what this will do is it will open a dialog box to choose the file path and then it will copy the file path into your text box okay so just write these three lines just pause the video if you want and then copy and paste these these lines then what I have done is I will once again go to my form so this is choosing the file now how to start the video I will click start video button double click it and I need to add these two lines so what are these two lines I will just select my windows media player and copy the name of my windows media player from here just copy all the name and paste it here arrow pointer URL 
is equal to text box which is your text box name arrow pointer text so what this line will do it will pass whatever is in the text box in the form of URL in the Windows Media Player and the second line just the same window media player variable then arrow pointer ctl controls arrow pointer play so this line will play the video so it will start the video so just write these two lines and then once again go to your form and in here once again write or, or double click your stop button so I will double click this stop button and here you just need to add this one line which is the name of your window media player which is AX window media player 1 by default arrow pointer CTL controls arrow pointer stop so this will stop your windows media player so I have done these three button codes and now let's once again run our code and how it's running so this is my form and when I choose a file I can choose any file I choose a file of my video which I have made and I will just mute the volume so it will not distract the video and I just start video and it started okay and when I just press the stop button it stop now I want to play some other video so I once again click choose video I choose other video and then I press once again start video so it shows the other video and then once again stop so in this way you can choose any video which is present in your PC or notebook and play in this form within the form so this is very useful application for your project if you want and I hope you have learned some new thing this time so please rate comment and subscribe and keep watching the videos bye for now